Hello fellow witches and wizards, my name is Phoenix Jenny and welcome to another video. Um, welcome to another video about my Patreon. Um, so I have just released this morning um, chapter two of my new mystery novel, uh, The Applewood Tales Secrets at Crandall School, and I wanted to share about it to make sure that you know about it. Um, so if you didn't know, um, if you're a new subscriber, um, or what have you, I am not just a YouTuber, I'm also a writer and I write short stories and poetry and, uh, essays and all kinds of stuff, mostly short stories. Um, and I post that stuff on Patreon. Um, and if you don't know what Patreon is, Patreon is a website where creators, um, musicians, artists, um, or writers like me can post their content and people can pay to enjoy their content. Um, and uh, I will show you it. I will show you my Patreon. Uh, right here. This is my Patreon and it's linked in the description. Um, it's patreon.com slash phoenix jenny. That's me. You won't be able to find me if you search me in the search box. If you just go to Patreon and just search for me, you won't find me because I'm not big enough for their browser. So, um, but, um, that is the, the link is in the description and it's right here. Patreon.com slash phoenix jenny. This is what it looks like. Um, right now we're on the creator view. So let me show the patron view. This is what you're going to see when you go there. Um, and, uh, this is my content that I post. Um, this is what I posted today. Um, you do have to become a patron to read it. Although chapter one is free. Chapter one is right here. You just click continue reading cause it'll open it up and you can read the chapter so you can see what it's about and see if you're interested in reading more. Um, so what I posted today is a mystery novel. And um, it's my very first mystery novel that I've ever written. Um, I'm quite, I, I'm quite pleased with it. It's all written. I just need to write the last chapter um, and uh, clean up the other chapters. I'm going to be releasing a chapter every other month um, because I'm also working. I'm also writing Harry Potter fan fiction, which I will explain in a second. Um, but. This is my mystery novel. I created it when I was doing dishes at my parents' house one day. I like made up the whole thing, sitting there doing the dishes, just kind of went through the whole thing. Okay, who are my suspects? What what are my clues? This clue is going to lead to the next clue, which is going to lead to the next clue, and how's it all going to end? And I just formed this whole mystery in my head while I was doing the dishes, and so I have written this mystery novel. Um, uh, it's going to be part of a series. Um, the Applewood Tales is basically about a private detective named Violet Applewood, and that's where the Applewood Tales comes in. And these are her different cases, and so this is just um, one of her cases. It's going to be like a Sherlock Holmes kind of thing where there's episodes rather than just this one big story. Um, uh, but this is... Uh, a story, a mystery novel, um, where a student at an elite girl's private school has been pushed down a flight of stairs and she had a head injury. Um, and, uh, basically the mystery is we got to figure out who pushed her down the stairs. And so, um, Miss Applewood, Violet Applewood has been invited to come to the school and meet all the suspects and, gather all the clues and the facts and she's going to uncover more and more secrets that's why it's called secrets at crandall school she's going to uncover all these different secrets that all these people have to find the culprit in the end um so if you're interested if you like mystery uh and you're interested you can read chapter one for free and you could see if it's something that you'd be interested in reading further and then you can become a patron um, for $5 a month, um, and you can immediately unlock chapter two and read chapter two. And when you're a patron, uh, you're, when you are a patron, you'll have access to the other chapters that I'll be posting throughout the year. 
and you have access to everything else I have on here because I have more things than just this story. Um, I also have um, fan fiction here. This is my Harry Potter fan fiction. You can see what I have up here in these different links. I have a ton of free posts. My fan fiction is free, by the way. You don't have to become a patron. Um, you can just come to the website and you just click continue reading and you can just read it. You don't have to pay. It doesn't lock you out. Um, if you do have to pay, it will have, uh, it, it says unlocked for me because I'm the creator, but it'll say locked up here or something to that effect and it won't let you read it until you um, become a patron. Um, but um, uh, I have free posts. I have Harry Potter related posts. I have nine of them. Here's my fan fiction. I have a Halloween topic because I made a special um, project. I made a special video because I don't just have um, writing. I also have videos. Um, I made a, I wrote a horror story for Halloween and I made a video about it. Um, I read, I did a narration and I had an artist make artwork for it and I put music and sound effects on top of it. It's really, really cool. I'm thinking of making one that's free. Um, I'm thinking of making, of doing it again and it's going to be free and so that people can see what it's like and maybe that'll entice them to want to become a patron to see the stuff that's not free. Um, and I also want to do that for my mystery novel coming soon. This mystery novel that I'm that I just released, you can read it now, but I'm also thinking of doing a narration like I did with my Halloween horror story. Um, uh, if in, in case you are not somebody that likes to read but would rather be read to, I'm going to do narrations as well. Um, uh, but I also have videos. I also have uh, a Let's Watch of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone that I posted um, that is free, and uh, you can watch it right now. Um, if you choose to come and view anything, I ask that you would leave a like by uh, clicking the heart right there so I can know how many people have liked it, so I know how many people have engaged with it. Um, that would be very helpful to me. Um, I have more stuff on here too. Mystery novel. I have an essay. I have something I wrote for Memorial Day last year. Narration. Personal narrative poem and video. But these are the most um, popular ones. Um, and more to come. So um, if you want to enjoy this content, uh, consider becoming, becoming a patron. Um, you can go to membership. I'm going to edit this here. I might, I, I'm going to look at this, but for now, this is what it is. It's $5 a month. Um, and you just uh, click join. Um, well, yeah, there's an error because I can't join my own Patreon. But I, I, I wanted to see if I could show you what it looks like, but it looks like I can't. But, um, uh, but you can join there for $5 a month. Now, if you're in a situation where you don't want to pay for multiple months, you just want to read one specific thing, you can do that. What you can do is you can subscribe and just pay that $5 that one time and then read it and then unsubscribe. It is not hard to unsubscribe. I've done it myself. You can just unsubscribe. You can pay that one month and then unsubscribe and then wait until you see something else that you want to read that's locked behind a paywall and just pay that one time and then unsubscribe. Um, uh, you can subscribe uh, just to support me as well. You can do that. Um, and then unsubscribe when you're not interested in what I'm making and then resubscribe when you are interested. You can do that sort of thing too. It doesn't have to be a constant thing. Um, I just have it set up. I would have it set up to where you only pay for what you want. Um, but I can't, I, it won't let me do that because I'm a smaller Patreon creator. So, um, I'm limited in what I can do. Um, but yeah, so if you're interested, this is my content and I, and I hope that you will enjoy and, uh, enjoy more content to come. Um, so yeah, um, thank you so much for watching and, um, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.